Greetings and welcome to another episode of Trippy Food and another installment of Top of the Pops. Today we are going to do the brand new, brand new Mountain Dew Spark. Uh, this is by popular demand. A lot of, uh, on the live stream, a lot of people have been asking us when we're going to do the Mountain Dew Spark. And then actually, to be fair, it's just recently come up. Hi Doodle. Hey Doodle. <laughs> Doodle, the Prince of Dogness. Um, and so it's recently come out. Now, I, I found out that they have actually two flavors. So they have the regular flavor and then they have the zero flavor. Now, the Spark is supposed to taste like uh, raspberry lemonade, I believe. Yep. So we'll see how, how good it is. Again, we are joined by Matt Zion from Retro Seeking. And um, so I think the last time I did one of these uh, was maybe um, on a Retro Seeding episode where we did the gingerbread one. Okay. Yeah, that was, that was good. I was high as hell. <laughs> <laughs> really? Oh, wow, I was so high, yeah. All right, so um, so in your opinion, we should start with the zero. Always go diet first. Okay, yeah. so I think that one's Diet's the gonna be the neutered version of the flavor. I prefer diet as a whole though. I think uh, regular soda is just too sweet these days. Diet Mountain Dew is questionable though. It's really hit and miss. Regular Diet Mountain Dew I don't is know not that I don't know that I've had a Diet Mountain Dew. Yeah, and I don't know. If you're gonna go diet, you gotta go cola. Diet, when it comes to uh, fruity sodas, doesn't work as well. It's like they're designed to be really sweet. Doodle, I'm sorry, I only have two glasses. Man, that is for, that is for kids. <laughs> that is, God, that is oh. so sweet. And really syrupy. It's initially good, and then it gets bad. Yeah. It's yeah, it's like uh it's like uh, somebody melted Jolly Ranchers. Yeah, like a like an Otter Pop or something. It's but, just. Too, but then there's that artificial sweet. sweet flavor too. That's because it's diet. I don't yeah. think the regular one's gonna have that. Uh, yeah, again, diet, diet fruity sodas just don't really work. Mm. It's not awful. It's not great either. Yeah, it's just like, give me anything else. <laughs> you know? <coughs> I've had way worse sodas though. I think I'm gonna give it a thumbs in the middle. Yeah. So it's like, like I could take it or leave it. I don't know that I would go out of my way to get that again. No. You know, it's it's certainly not like the gingerbread win, or what was the other one? The thrashed apple? Have yeah. you done the thrashed no, apple No, I never yet? did that. Oh, that was, you gotta get, that was only you. Yeah. You gotta get, get, I gotta think get it's done. Apple. I think it's done. I don't... I think it's done. I'm trying to think if I've seen, yeah, seen I'm it. Pretty, I'm pretty sure it's done. Oh, it but was really knows? good. Yeah, I one, of my favorite, one of my favorites. All right, so now we're gonna try the regular spark. Okay. Look at those calories and look at that sugar. I can't get my mind around it. Oh, yeah. From zero sugar to 77 grams. Ooh, it even smells different. I can't drink regular soda or regular energy drinks anymore. Oh, same know. year. I haven't in years. You know, obviously for the show I have. On uh, our channel, Old Man Tom, that's all he drinks is regular soda. Really? He can't, he thinks the diet ones will kill him. And I always tell him, look at how much sugar is in that! <laughs> diet meat is... Yeah, that makes sense. Cute, man. All right. That one smells way better. Yeah, I think so too. Oh, it tastes man. better. That would make a great mixed drink, It tastes too. better, yeah. Put a little vodka in there. Ooh, that's good. It seems like it seems like the flavor's lighter though. The flavor's lighter than the zero one. Yeah, but it doesn't have that like syrupiness, and that's what. Yeah, because the zero one's trying too hard. Yeah, this is more like a traditional like lemonade style uh, thing. Has um, has Mountain Dew done lemonade style uh, drinks before? Oh yeah, there's a, to, maybe remember. it's my imagination, but it seems like there's more tartness. There's more like the lemon tartness from this. In yeah, this one. yeah. So it definitely it's just better all around. Lemonade. It's way too sweet, though. There's no way I can do that. Yeah. No. I don't know. What do you ne think? Neither of these. They're they're both just middle middle for me. They they have cons and pluses both. Just the unhealthy nature of this one is gonna make me never want to drink a full one. Uh, flavor wise, it's good though, but it's a little. It's just they're both just like too sweet in their own ways. This tastes better for sure, so it's almost a thumbs up. This is like barely or uh, barely a thumbs, thumbs middle. Th 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 almost a thumbs down. down. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, this one I like because it seems to have more of the tanginess of the lemonade. Yeah. But I, I agree with you completely. It's it's not it's not worth the second try. I just do think. like Diet Coke. <laughs> I can't think of any like fruity diet sodas that I ever liked. I love diet energy drinks. Those are great. I always feel like those hit the mark, but these are just these are no no thank you. And there's only just a hint of the raspberry. Yeah. There's not really much raspberry. Yeah, so yeah, a thumbs in the middle on that one. On uh, th uh, this one, thumbs in the middle going upwards a little bit, thumbs in that one going down a little yeah, bit. Yeah, I agree. You know, um, we tried them because you asked us to. 
And they'll keep asking, and I'll just have to link your video every time that they get the request. Yeah. So post this quickly. When please. they ask you, they go like, "Yeah, we did it on Dallas channel. Go watch it." There. They keep I'm asking. It. I've been. This one's got a lot of requests. From well, this one and the and the uh, flaming hot one, but I can't find the flaming hot one. Anymore. The flaming hot Mountain Dew. Oh, yeah. that's you can only buy that. You could only buy that online at the and time. And it sold out in it's, minutes. And it was done in like, yeah. well, less than a minute. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, you have to buy a third. Got it. Yeah, you have to buy a third party now, and it's like I think it's like sixty dollars for a can. It's, it's not, not worth it. No. Yeah. Nope. If anyway you have one, oh, and uh, you're willing to part with it, and and you're not you're not expecting us to pay sixty bucks for it, let us know. Oh, we'll try that. But other than that, these burps are bad. <laughs> um, yeah. So hopefully this is only mid time only, and they don't bring it back. But um, yeah. but I've seen the gingerbread one still on. So. Yeah. I, well, it's, my theory on that is no one bought it. Oh, really? So that's why it's like an overstock because it's we're well past the when they released that. Yeah, well, this, it's yeah, not a Christmas permanent time, flavor. Right? Yeah, it's not a permanent <laughs> flavor. Yeah. So there you go. Uh, so be sure to uh, check out Reckless Eating. Uh, check them out on all the social media platforms they're on and YouTube. Be sure to subscribe, like, follow, all that stuff. Yeah, just do it. all that stuff. And um, but be careful because it's crazy out there. So take care of yourselves. Take care of others. We'll see you soon. Thanks for checking out Trippy Food. If you enjoyed watching that video half as much as I did making it, well then I enjoyed it twice as much as you did. And if that's the case, you'll probably like this video right here. And if not, check out this video right here. That one's a little bit different. Either way, leave a comment down below. And be sure to subscribe by clicking on the Trippy Food icon right here. Glad you could make it, and we hope to see you again soon.